Quality of service. Quality of service QoS, is an inter networking issue. We can define quality of service as the capability of a network to provide quality services to a network. It manages traffic to reduce packet loss and delays. The primary goal of QoS is to provide priority for a specific type of data. For example, real time transmission like video, audio, online games need more priority over passive data like file transfer. And QoS deals with these four parameters to give better services reliability, delay, jitter, and bandwidth. Reliability. Reliability is a characteristic that a packet in the network needs. In case, if we lose a packet or acknowledgement, it needs to be retransmitted. It is more important for file transfer, electronic mail, and internet access to have reliable transmissions than telephony or audio conferencing. Guaranteeing the delivery of each packet is nothing but reliability. Delay. How much time does a packet take to travel from source to destination is called delay. The delay in file transfer, email services is tolerable, but audio or video conferencing, telephony need minimum delay. Jitter. The variation in delay for packets belonging to the same receiver is referred to as jitter. For example, if three packets depart at times 1, 2, 3, and arrive at 31, 32, 33, all have the same delay of 30 units. On the other hand, if the above packets arrive at 33, 31, and 38, they will have different delays. For audio and video transmission, the first case is completely acceptable, the second case is not. Bandwidth. A network needs appropriate bandwidth for a specific application. For example, video conferencing needs to send millions of bits per second. This needs higher bandwidth. While file transfer may not reach even a million bits per second, a lower bandwidth for this application is acceptable. Now, we will see the techniques to improve quality of service. Techniques to improve QoS. We must improve the quality of service of a network for reliable delivery of data. There are some techniques to improve the quality of service. We discuss some of them, they are scheduling, traffic shaping, admission control, and resource reservation. Scheduling. Usually, a router or a switch gets packets from different flows for processing. All the packets from different flows must be treated fairly to get a good quality of service. We discuss some of the scheduling techniques that improve QoS. They are FIFO queuing, priority queuing, and weighted fair queuing. FIFO queuing. This is called first in, first out queuing. In this method, packets wait in a buffer or queue until the node is ready to process them. If the arrival rate is higher than the processing rate, the queue will fill up, and the new packets after that will be discarded. Here, the oldest entry is processed first. That is, the packets leave the queue in the order in which they arrive. Priority queuing. Here, we have two types of queues higher priority queue and lower priority queue. The packets as they enter are first assigned to a priority class. That is, time sensitive data goes to higher priority queue. Other data like file transfers goes to lower priority queue. The packets in the highest priority queue are processed first. And the packets in the lowest priority queue are processed last. A priority queue provides better quality of service than the FIFO queue, because higher priority traffic can reach the destination with less delay. But, there is a drawback here. If there is a continuous flow in a high priority queue, the packets in the lower priority queues will never have a chance to be processed. This condition is called starvation. Weighted fair queuing. This technique is same as priority queuing. But the queues are weighted based on the priority of the queues. Higher priority means a higher weight. The system processes packets in each queue in a round robin fashion, with the number of packets selected from each queue, based on the corresponding weight. For example, if the weights are 2, 3, and 
Three packets are processed from the second queue, two packets from the first queue, and one from the third queue.